Hey everybody out in Facebook land, it's Cassandra with John L. Scott coming to you live from the very sultry and warm backyard in Portland. It's like 95 degrees here, it's kind of stupid. Um, but you know, whatever, it's summer, I shouldn't be complaining, at least it's not, you know, negative 60 like a lot of my family had in Minnesota this winter, so... Anyways, it is Tuesday, and um, I decided to do a live tip Tuesday. Uh, I know it's a little late, but let's get it done. So last week, we talked a little bit about uh, interest rates. So did you know that your interest rate on your mortgage is directly co correlated with your credit score? Um, some people do, but yeah, some people don't. It, it is. Um, credit scores range anywhere from up to 850 down to you know 580 and sometimes even less um, so you know there's a very wide range and there's a lot of things that go into a credit score we'll get into that next week but this week um, let's talk a little bit about there are five ranges of credit scores that lenders place you in um, to assist in determining what your interest rate is going to be on your mortgage so you know let's start with the 580 to 620 obviously you're you're eligible for a mortgage um, and a good lender will help you figure out the best strategy to get that score up and you know, as you know, the scores, the better score you get, the better interest rate you get. So a good lender will be able to figure out, you know, they'll look at all your debts and everything that's going on and they'll, they'll be able to build you a good strategy as to how to increase that score over time. So, you know, you might not want to get your interest rate, you know, use the interest rate you got now, but they say, hey, six months, pay these down this amount. And you're like, yeah, totally doable. And you know, you can get your, your interest rate down. So the next is 620 to 680. That's a moderate to good credit score, and buyers in this range can also still benefit from talking to a good lender. But you know, you're gonna get a little bit of a better interest rate when you get there. Um, the next up is from 680 to 740, which is a good credit score. Um, you'll get pretty good rates, but obviously still very much room for improvement. And then last, there is the 740 to 850 score. So that is excellent, excellent credit score. You know, you're gonna get top prime rates for that, and which is awesome. Um, but the other thing let's talk about too real quick before this Tip Tuesday is over, um, is a little bit about how much a good credit score can save you. So I talked to my lender, uh, Michael with Priority, and he said that for someone that would do a $350,000 loan with 80% loan to value, so that means you put 20% down on the loan, um, that, if you had a 620 credit score and you were looking to get an interest rate, you're probably gonna be paying a quarter to three eighths of a point more than somebody with a 740 credit score. And so let me let me put this into a dollar amount. You know, you're looking at over the life of your 30 year loan at least somewhere around twenty thousand dollars just in interest that you're gonna pay difference. And for some people, um, you know, that's that's a year of college for your kids, or a new car, or you know, a couple vacations. So I mean, it does add up, and it is worth working down with your lender, you know, your payments to get your interest rate um, a little bit lower. So tip Tuesday for Tuesday, June eleventh is know your credit score, monitor your credit score. Um, your lender should be able to help you. There's also a plethora of things um, available on the internet. I know like I use TransUnion and they have a credit, or mon or credit monitoring service that gives me my credit score and tells me whether it went up or went down every month. So if you guys have any questions too, um, let me know and I can get you in touch with a really great lender. I've got a couple that are amazing. Um, and let's, you know, Let's do this. Let's um, work on being able to know what all these things mean, whether it's interest rates or um, credit scores and how they apply to your life. Um, I really wish that schools these days would teach you know, the life skill type of thing. But anyways, I'm not gonna get on any more of a rant. So thanks for tuning in. Tip Tuesday is know your credit score, monitor your credit score and work on it because it's only gonna help you in the long run. So everybody, stay cool, get a beverage, and enjoy your day. I will see y'all next week. Have a wonderful day. Bye.